I have already installed this app and I have downloaded uh, this one. As you can see, it uses PHP 7.0 uh, to continue this tutorial. You need to know about the PHP version you have. Uh, to find that, uh, run this app, then start the Apache, then go to the localhost. Click on the PHP info. In here, you can see your PHP version. You can download uh, Xdebug from here. I have a SAMP 32 bit version, so I'm going to choose a 32 bit DLL. Make sure you have installed a relevant C redistribution package as well. For mine, I need Visual C14, and I have already installed that one. Place the downloaded DLL file in the PHP EXT folder. Then edit the php.ini file. Search the, this keyword and if you have found any, just comment it out. Then find this keyword as well. Uh, then if you find uh, any uh, section, uh, just comment it, uh, comment that uh, as well. Then uh, search for this xdebug. If you have find any, uh, then remove the entire section and add these lines. Uh, if you haven't found any, just add these lines at the bottom of the uh, your INA file. You can see that uh, xdebug is loaded now. Open Visual Studio Code. Search for the PHP debug extension and install it. Now go to this uh, page and I will put all links in the description. Click on the generate. Now drag and drop it to your toolbar like this. And I have already created a small PHP script to test the debugger. Click on the debugger. Now add a breakpoint. Click on the start debugger. Refresh the page. You can see that it's working. I hope uh, this will help your projects. And thanks for watching. Have a nice day.